Do you lack consistency on your volley? Are you tired of getting picked on up at the net? Is your partner frustrated because you keep failing to put away balls? Not to worry, because in this video, I'm gonna show you the best volley drill ever. Hey there, Ramon Osu with you here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you what very well may be the greatest volley drill ever created, because you're gonna have the basis for creating control, feel, and be able to put the ball away, so you're like the wall and the hero for your doubles team. So without further ado, let's head out to the courts and I'll show you what I'm talking about. I learned this drill years ago when I got serious about learning how to play tennis the right way, and I recently taught this at a tennis summit where I was asked to teach the most powerful volley drill that I knew. So here's the drill. You're gonna bump the ball up to yourself and then bump it across the net. That's it. Now I can hear you now. That looks too simple, Ramon. Piece of cake. And well, it may appear that way and you may even get it right off the bat. It didn't happen for me that way. I struggled with this drill for a long time because I had a ton of bad habits on the volley. But let me break it down for you and then show you some of the finer points on this drill. Now what's great about this drill is it gives you instant feedback on the quality of your volley contact. When you do it correctly, the ball should pop pretty much straight up into the air, and the second hit will be super easy. But if you're a little bit off on the first hit, it'll be pandemonium, and we'll have to hide the women and children. Specifically, what you're trying to do each and every time is first line up your hips to the 45 degree angle, and stretch your hitting arm out along the opposite 45 degree angle into the court, like this, like you're moving to catch a ball. Simultaneously, you want to move your body into position that allows you to comfortably stretch out along that 45 degree angle so we're extending our arm at contact. In other words, you don't want to be like the T-Rex and you don't want to be off balance trying to overstretch for the ball either. Now the next point is your hand should be really relaxed for that initial bump. If you grip too tightly, the ball is going to skyrocket off your racket and you won't be developing much feel. You're looking for more of a grip tension that is like hitting a drop shot. So really soft on the first hit, kind of like you're catching an egg. Okay, next, you want to make sure your racket face isn't totally open because you can cheat in this drill just by laying the racket completely open, but it defeats the purpose of the effectiveness of this drill. Your racket face should be partially open, just like it would be if you're going to hit your volley. So sort of leading with that bottom edge slightly. Now once the ball pops straight up, smoothly bump the ball back to your partner and repeat the process over again. You can do this on the forehand and the backhand side and it's awesome. One kind of troubleshooting tip, if the ball is moving forward after your first bump out of your reach, after that first bump, you're probably out in front of the 45 degree angle. You're, you're too early on the point of contact. You've stretched too far. If the ball is going backward after the first bump, most likely your contact is probably late. You're behind the 45 degree angle. So have fun with this one. It really is that drill that if we were on a deserted island and somehow had a tennis court and we could just only take one volley drill with us, this would be the one we would take. And if you practice it correctly, you will master it. And you'll start to have complete control over your volleys and start dominating your doubles matches. Thanks so much for watching this video. I had a great time making it for you, as did the pugs, as we always do. And uh, let me know in the comments down below how you can best use this drill to maximize your volleys on the court. In the meantime, don't forget to like and share this video with someone who you know needs help with their volleys, maybe your doubles partner, and subscribe if you like these videos. Thanks again for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.